Hi everybody, welcome to the Off the Grid Revolution. We're in the greenhouse again today. It's like January, so it's mostly get rid of stuff and get ready for spring and do other things. Speaking of doing other things, you note that the word revolution is in our title. Well, we're talking about joining the Bernie Sanders Revolution. We hope all of you will do the same because we think that that's the way that this country needs to go. So while we're trying to continue to do things to feed people and to feed ourselves and to make the world a better place on a personal level, we're also going to try to do it on a political level. Bernie's one only person I've ever talked about or heard about in politics who said a revolution. But you know what? The guy's absolutely right. So while you're doing other things like fixing up your greenhouse or uh, cooking dinner, think about what you can do for Bernie Sanders and then get out there and do some of it. Uh, make some We've talked about this last week. Make brochures for him and take them to places where they should be. When you pull out tomato plants, take lots of the dirt with you, okay, and, and toss it out because there's likely to be cooties in there that could grow next year and ruin your garden. So they just go into the compost pile. Uh, yeah, do things for Bernie Sanders. Make some black and white brochures that are easy to copy and to take uh, to places subject specific like um, the, the, the Humane Society or the animal shelters you go to. There's a brochure about how he feels about animals. Okay, get that and take it with you. When you want to go to the bank, Take some of his information about banks. Get out there and do these things. Do them for Bernie because he needs you. Um, this is our revolution. It's not just him, okay? We have to do this with him. He said that over and over again. If you're having a hard time talking to people about Bernie, all you really need to do, oh, don't pull up your parsley because parsley can last quite a while yet. Joe, um, you gotta take some of this home for your, sm uh, for your smoothies. Okay, mm -hmm. we'll do. Hmm. Pardon me, folks, for eating in front of me, but I can't help it. When I get in the greenhouse, I have to. It's part of my revolutionary attitude. Pulling up old tomato plants because they're shot. No more fruit from them. This stuff doesn't taste good. It doesn't. So it's pretty much put it in the dirt and hope it comes back as its own tomato and uh, plant next year. Most folks don't like doing that in the garden, but I'm going to give it a try. I've heard it works. Um, make videos for Bernie like we're doing right now. This stuff is so simple. Um, if I get this wrong, Joe, you, you chime in. Basically, get out your phone, point it at yourself or someone else, and talk about Bernie. To do that, and then uh, post it on Facebook or post it on, on YouTube. Is that the gist of it, Joe? That's the gist of nah, it. It's so easy to get out there and make videos for Bernie. Do it, people! Do it, people! We need you now! Okay, all the way across the country. Also, go to his website, berniesanders.com, uh, and learn about him. If you have a hard time, if you're having a hard time talking to people about Bernie, here's what you do. You just say, listen, I know he believes what you believe. All you have to do is read about him, people. Just go read about him. And uh, he'll convince people on their own. He'll convince them. It's just, it's that simple. His policies are so good. He's so right. He's so honest. Um, he is the revolution that we need. Okay? Just... Tell people to read about it, because I can't imagine anybody not being willing to do that. Randy, okay? is there a website that you would recommend? Oh, man. BernieSanders.com, BernieSandersVideo.com, um, BernieSanders2016. Um, go to his website. Uh, I think it's BernieSanders.com. That's, that's probably the best way to go. Okay. I'll um, put those three in the video description, so there'll be okay. links right with the video. That works. Thanks, Joe. That works. Um, look how the lettuce is still growing. Um, as it gets colder and colder, it need, it's not getting the sunlight that it needs, and so it's not getting as lush as it was. But I gotta say again, though, it's, it's January. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> mmm, mm. and it's not bitter. My mind is in the gutter, especially when it comes to my lettuce. I love it. See how this stuff's died? We showed you the pumpkin last week. It's shot. Got to get it out. The the uh, the peppers froze. Ah, the peppers froze. Peppers take lots of dirt and I don't know why they do that look at that but they do they take lots of dirt excuse me Joe I'll be right back okay I'm back Sorry. okay you're back I'm, I'm, wor I'm working in a greenhouse and I'm trying to make this video about Bernie because that's what the off-grid revolution is all about things you care about when you care about two things sometimes you got to do them both so making videos making brochures make your own signs okay um, 
Take a political sign and turn it inside out. Take a sheet of cardboard and make something on it. Um, make signs. Put them in your front yard. Put your own wiring on them. Use coat hangers or whatever you need to do. Hold now that's very Occupy like. Oh, it's very Occupy. Occupy does that all the time. We recycle old political signs. It's wonderful when it's somebody we don't um, agree with to make a sign out of them that's for something we do agree with. That's wonderful to do. Um, it's uh, in Now how would we do that? You take a, a political sign um, that you've gotten out of the trash or recycling or had around or your neighbor had around, turn the sign inside out and then you have a canvas because the inside of political signs are all plain. Okay, there's nothing written on the inside. That's the canvas you use. If it's cardboard, you can write on it or paint on it. If it's plastic, you have to paint on it. Um, and make a sign, say Bernie Sanders 2016 and put it somewhere. Okay, that's all you, real easy to do. Take pieces of cardboard and make a little Bernie Sanders brochure and write a little bit of one of his issues and put it up um, at the grocery store, at the post office, at church, wherever you're going. Put up stuff about him because we have to take on the corporate media. We have to take on uh, the one tenth of one percent and the one percent. Okay, we need to we need to do this revolution now. This is our chance. Okay, occupy. <coughs> was a great, great start, and it got us on the track of where we need to be. We did, if we, we had Bernie Sanders um, in our hearts when we were doing the things we did in Occupy. This is, and, and it's amazing how he's transcended places that Occupy didn't. Like, he's got Republicans who, who, who believe in what he believes. It's, he's so basic in terms of what America needs that he crosses the bounds of libertarians and conservatives and progressives and, and, and left-wing radicals and occupiers. And it's amazing. It's amazing. The, the breadth of people, because like I said earlier, if you listen to what he says, if you read what he believes, you're, you're, in, you're on board. It's pretty much... That simple. I, the people who have told me that they're not on board are, uh, are uh, almost none across. And because when you start talking about the issues and what he believes, it's so good for us. It's, it's where our country needs to go. Um, I've said before, I didn't think I'd ever want to campaign for another politician. Okay. I, I have said that before, and, and I really meant it. In my heart, after being disappointed with political process in the past, I said, I can't do this anymore. I'm just going to take care of my gardening and feeding people and uh, that kind of stuff. And now with Bernie, my greenhouse is a mess because it's time to do something for him. I'm, I'm doing it and I hope you guys will do it too. Make the signs, make the brochures, um, make the videos, uh, spread the word, get out there one-on-one. -on -one. Don't wait for someone else to tell you what to do. Get out there and do it. Okay. Bye, everybody. Thanks, Randy.